Hello everybody, welcome back to another episode of Clash of Clans with Logini Games. I wanted to show you guys this war matchup that we just got last night against level 10 beginner clan. Lots of irony in that name. But before we jump over there to the enemy side of the, of the war map, let me show you our side. We've got Town Hall 10s and Town Hall 9s down to number 5. We've got, you know, Reflex as a young Town Hall 10. Uh, Happy and Town Hall 8s go all the way down to number 10. And then we've got Town Hall 7s and we actually... Uh, scale all the way down to some Town Hall 4s and 5s and even a couple Town Hall 3s uh, Just because we have young members new members young clashers who are trying to cut their teeth in war and it does help us with some of our war matchups, but uh, Not in this case. So let's jump over to beginner clan. Remember. This is our top five Here's their top five and uh, when I first saw this I thought wow we Definitely have outmatched these guys uh, matchmaking has definitely turned out in our favor their town hall 10 is really good uh, Their number two uh, their town hall nine right there is really maxed uh, So lots of props to these guys for being strong up top uh, But we this looks like we've outmatched them and are probably gonna have a pretty easy win against these guys So as I scroll down all right their town hall eights down to number nine uh, So again, we've even got more town hall eights than they do or maybe the same amount and then uh, scrolling down, wait, there's a, there's a what? There's a Town Hall 11 at 15, and it is no slouch. It's a defense only, or like a single defense base, completely engineered Town Hall 11, complete with Grand Warden <laughs> at, at at least level 5. I mean, it's a nice uh, offensive Town Hall 11. I'll show you that. Well, and then there's another Town Hall 10, number 17. And then everything just goes south. Lots and lots of engineered bases. All the way down to number 25. All of those are engineered with a single defense, level 1 cannon. And uh, upgraded clan castles, upgraded troops, etc, etc. With the exception of number 20. I'm very appreciative for number 20 because we might actually stand a chance with some of our lower town halls against him. Uh, but let's just jump in and take a quick look at this town hall 11. There you go. Well upgraded, not maxed out in terms of uh, storages and that kind of thing, but level 15 king, level 17 archer queen, level 5 grand warden, and uh, not too shabby on the troops either. Maxed out valkyries, I mean, maxed out dragons. Man, uh, look at the spells, looking really good. So, pretty insane. Heavily, heavily engineered. Uh, so, something that I thought was a pretty interesting war matchup. I know that uh, Supercell is trying to do something about those quote-unquote lopsided bases but here they are coming out strong all of these being uh, heavily engineered not sure uh, how this is going to turn out for us because these guys uh, like I said even up here at the top are very very strong these town hall nines and that town hall 10 so uh, there's this is going to be an interesting matchup uh, they could very well uh, they're going to do pretty well against us and we could do pretty well against them uh, we may have a draw double perfect war so we will have to see i'll let you guys know uh after the war battle day has uh, has gone through and we'll see exactly what our results are going to be very very interesting matchup though i wanted to know what you guys think about engineered bases or lopsided bases of course uh, i've shared my opinion before that if you're that dedicated to the game to have a lopsided base uh man i'm not going to foul you for it because i feel like you have to you have to accept a certain level of uh of a disadvantage in order to have that advantage that advantage comes with a defensive disadvantage so i know some people get all upset about engineered bases but we'll go ahead and use their disadvantage uh, to three star all these bases real easily although we may have to do some reaching down uh, maybe to hit that town hall 11 with a town hall 8 but uh pretty interesting stuff guys interesting stuff again they do have an offensive advantage on us so we may both uh, be coming out strong with this one very interesting stuff you guys can let me know what you think in the comment section I'll be interested to see uh, how supercell is going to uh, be making adjustments to matchmaking obviously the adjustments that they've made uh, Have not deterred the engineered bases. So all right guys. Thank you so much for watching this video I look forward to showing you guys what comes of it, and I'll talk to you again soon